Uh, okay, in this tutorial, I'll explain about how to use a schedule in Revit uh, to calculate the quantity of your devices in lighting fixture. So I just simply use the sample architecture project uh, in one of the default file. But you just you just you can just use uh, your Revit file after you locate all the lighting fixtures. So this one is just simply. Um, the sample uh, house design and if you check level one uh, then actually this is one is level two actually to see the lighting fixture actually you need to see the RCP so to see that um, you need to go to uh, plan views and reflected ceiling plan and then I'll just make a RCP on level one. Then as you see that there are two lighting fixtures here. And actually there are several more. So now we want to know how many lighting fixtures uh, we have in this project. So to calculate that, uh, all you need to do is just simply going to analyze. And then there's a schedule under reports and schedules uh, tab. So I just click this schedule. And here, uh, lighting fixtures are under uh, after grids. So please do not select lighting devices. Just use lighting fixtures. Then simply click OK. Then you will see a lot of options or called parameters that you can use. So for now, I will include them all. So I will click the first one and click the last one uh, with pressing Shift button and left mouse button. And then by using this Add Parameters button, you can actually add all these parameters in your schedule sheet and then all you have to do is just simply click OK then now you have this nice uh, uh, schedule which has all the parameters and quantities and cost and count also some electric type and family type and all other additional information uh, you can work in here but I would recommend for you to use actually Excel uh, software so now what we have to do is simply export this schedule as a text file and we will open it in Microsoft Excel. So to export this file, simply go to R button. Then there's a export menu. And then if you go down, you will see report. And report, actually you can export a schedule or room area report. Then actually I will select a schedule. Then just select a folder you can remember easily. And actually, this is the file that I'm going to. And make sure that you select a delimited text. And then I'll click Save. And actually, I already tried one, but it's just kind of, I just over uh, replace it. Then it will ask you to what kind of a delimiter will you use. Delimiter is actually separating columns by columns. And in this case, we are going to use comma as a delimiter. And then uh, you don't really need to change all other things. And then I just press OK. Then actually your file is ready. Then you need to open this one in Excel, which is I just opened one. And then I'll just open the file. So I just select Open and Browse and go to Desktop. And then uh, I will simply select Lighting Fixture Schedule Text File. And then I click Open here. Then actually it will ask you that what kind of delimited uh, delimiter did you use before? So I select delimited, not fixed width. And then my data has a header. And go to next. And then in here actually we have to select comma which we used it. And now you probably see that all uh, data are divided by columns. And then uh, I just click uh, next. And there's some more additional things but I just click finished. So now this is the Excel file. Uh, you probably uh, see more nicely if you actually double click some uh, the end of the column and then you can actually delete or unnecessary information. So please make nice and clean. Also you can if you know the cost information you can actually calculate the cost. So uh, after you clean up some clean up and delete some unnecessary data you can uh, capture the screen of your computer and then please include this one uh, in your final project. Okay, thanks. That's it.